Hello, I am face first in the camera <laughs> today. That's the kind of video I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna be in your face. It's been about three months since I've uploaded anything and I thought, hmm, it's been about three months since I've uploaded anything. Let me get a video out. So, this is gonna be a brief, where have you been, Misa? Kind of video. So if you'd like, if you're feeling up for it, grab yourself a drink. Today I am iced coffee with a little bit of hemp and maple. I've got a stubs right here, uh, rubbing her head on a plant. I know my thickums. Oh, oh. She's upset. You see that? Whack, whack. Back in July, like I know that for a good while I actually had a solid set schedule that I was following and I will admit at the time I had a bit more free time and I had a set organized schedule that allowed me to, to edit at certain times and to upload at certain times and like certain days of the week were carved out specifically for these things and I feel like I was a lot more organized um, towards the summer and early like late summer, summertime. And whenever I had this idea for this video, I had it for some time and when October came, since it's like mental, mental health awareness is like a big thing in October and I told myself I wanna contribute to that and I want to have this video up for like in, cause it's in subjects, it's in the same subject. When I had the idea for that video and like I actually started recording for it, I it, since, since it was, since, that subject is very dear to me. I I hold high, like I hold a heavy heart when it comes to this kind of topic, when it comes to depression and suicide. So I know that with Auspicious Beginnings, those videos are a little more heavy set and for some of them I did like hit, I did like script, but they're just like scripting to where I just like have these like subjects and I just wanna hit these points in the video, but nothing I ever do is like verbatim scripted. Whenever I was uh, organizing the video for like suicide and depression and my experience with it and everything that that happens like in my experience with it, every time I tried to record the video, either something was going on like outside, there was a fire here in my complex and uh, they were like, they were doing a lot of construction and that would go on for a while. That was going on for a while. And whenever I did finally catch like quiet moments where it was appropriate, it felt appropriate, and I like wasn't working on other things for me to record. Some other external thing would happen where either they would start doing construction again, or there were a few times where when I was recording it, I just straight up did not like the footage that I got. Some of it was um, really good, and I feel like I kept a good like point, and there was one like full sit sitting that I did while I was recording that was really really good for me and I really really liked it but there were parts in it where they were doing construction and it was just really loud and when I came like to editing I was trying to like make it work and I just I got very frustrated <laughs> but I told myself I don't want to upload any videos until I get this one done like I was like straight up tunnel vision with this and next thing I know three months had passed and I've not uploaded any videos I will say, I am hearing my therapist's voice in my head saying, give yourself some grace. And I am doing exactly that. In the three months that I had spent away, there were a couple of big things that happened to me in that time and I just didn't have my focus on YouTube. For this like three months that I was off YouTube, I was also just flat out off of social media. I've not used my Instagram account in quite some time. Both accounts, like my art account or my um, my daily account, uh, as far as uh, I'm still on Facebook, but I usually just like that's how I communicate with. Um, uh, I don't know if I've mentioned this on the channel. But I'm also a go-go dancer. Like that's how I communicate with um, the groups. That's really it. Like even on YouTube, like I, I don't really watch other people's videos. I've not been like on any platforms. And I want, I really wish I could say I've been full on like focusing on my other mediums, like my 
my paintings, my drawings, and uh, reading a lot more, and writing, and doing all the other things that I love to do in my free time. I really wish I could say that, but I haven't. This entire time, I have been at work. I accidentally picked up a bunch of random shifts and I've pretty much been working back to back. And the days that I have off, I have been, like I've just been kind of like lingering around life and not really like existing, but not, this isn't like, none of this is in a negative context. I wouldn't change any of the events that have happened to me in the past three months. It's just, it's been the way it's been. Like it just is. And I'm okay with it. Like, you know, there are seasons that we go through where sometimes we just don't do things and sometimes you're just you're going about I don't think there's anything wrong with that uh, every now and again I did have moments where I'm like man I really wish I could just like I had the energy so my energy would be spent at work there were moments where I would say I really wish I just had some time to myself so I can do these things that I love and I simply didn't I feel like all I've done really <laughs> is like sleep and go to work I've not been here and it's not been bad, but it's not been good. It just is and that's okay. And I'm, I think it's okay to give yourself some grace whenever you have these kinds of seasons. And I've not had any like real solid like existential like, oh my God, I've not done anything with my life. Like what am I doing? Where am I going? Like I, I still have those moments, I'm human. But for the most part, I've been with myself and my partner in presence and they've been really nice but i've not forgotten about my channel i'm still active uh when i get comments i'll respond to them i don't know how many of you know this uh, i'm still an artist like i i'm still open for commissions like that's still something i do just um you can shoot me an email my email is going to be down in the description or you can like shoot me a message on facebook or instagram I want to say I'm going to start being a lot more active on these things and like I'm pursuing this like for sure for sure but I'm the kind of person that moves at her own pace and I don't quite feel like I'm ready to start reintroducing these kinds of things. My therapist used to use this analogy all the time. My whole thing is finding a solid balance and sometimes the balance tips. There are those like baby things that people put over cribs that um, the baby will like, if they tug on it, the whole thing will kind of like shake and it has to like move until it like reaches equilibrium again. Like this whole thing with it, I've just been trying to figure out what works for me in this season of my life so I can achieve a balance with it. I've put all of my mediums aside. I still love reading and I still love art and writing and learning and I still love all of that. I'm just trying to figure out what balance in my mediums works for me in this season of my life and I am giving myself grace as I figure that out. Although that has led to um, three months of not uploading. <laughs> That's okay because this is going to happen sometimes and it's okay. I still plan on recording and uploading my video on my experience with depression and suicidal attempts. I do have like a whole a whole ass journal of every like all of my video ideas and I still intend fully on you know getting those out and I even have new video ideas from this time that I've spent away. Inspired by you guys, I have a couple of, so my video on my astral projection experience has gotten a little bit of momentum. I had somebody ask a question about if I do anything specifically to like help protect myself whenever these things occur or like if I'm actively looking for these things, something along those lines and there are things that I do and if interested, I, I can upload a video on that. Nothing too crazy, it's pretty general stuff for me, but people are curious, I'm happy to do it. It's okay to not upload that video first. Let's get back into it. Let's let's see, let's get some videos out. I feel like I've got some really neat ideas and I've got things I wanna say and some people seem to be interested. So let's, let's do this together. 
let's learn from each other. Thank you so much to everybody that's like still here, everybody that's been here since day one, and everybody that's new. It's really neat because I've got I've got a few new subscribers and just like welcome to my little corner of the internet. My name is Nisa. It's a pleasure to meet you. I really, really, really enjoy when people are commenting and like active on my videos. It's so neat being able to like read and respond to comments. Like that's that's seriously the coolest thing ever. Like once I started getting like more and more comments on my videos, I'm like, oh my god, people are watching this. <laughs> this um, I'm just geeking out. You guys are awesome. Like seriously, y'all y'all rock. Peace out. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you to all of my my veteran friends. Uh, my veteran subscribers, my new subscribers, thank you so much for anyone that's active on my videos, every one of you that watches a video, y'all are incredible, I think it's really, really neat. I'll have my social links down below, feel free to go ahead and follow them, um, like my art page and um, do all of the social media things. If you like uh, my channel, I do vlogs about life as a creative, I talk about mental health and Sometimes I get into the nitty gritty of like trauma. If anything out here calls to you, feel free to subscribe and leave a comment. Whatever you wanna ask or say, I don't know. I don't know, I don't usually say like, leave a comment, subscribe, but I guess no, leave a comment and subscribe. <laughs> Peace out, my friends. Do you see that? Do you see her? She's tweaking. All right, everyone, I'll catch you later. Oh, that was kind of weird. It's been a while. Peace.